Yo, all right, lads. So today we're going to be reviewing Mohamed Al Salawi of Al Nasser in the Saudi League. He's five foot eleven tall, right footed to get high low work rates, a three star weak foot, and three star skills. His current price range is a nine point seven k to one hundred eighty k. That is on Xbox and on PlayStation as well. So looking at his in games, his standout so he's ninety five jumping, eighty eight finishing, eighty eight penalties, eighty four sprint speed, and eighty four attack positioning. We have also included all the upgrades over his non inform as a comparison, as we always do, so you can compare between the two. So you can always pause it for a close look at any of these now. So this is the team we'll be using him in. A 4-1-2-1-2 Saudi League team with Al Salawi at left striker. So now onto the gameplay so you can see how he was performing for me. Now looking at Al Salawi's card, he does look pretty nice with that 82 pace and that 82 shooting. And he did make a massive impact straight away, grabbing a hat trick on his debut. So I instantly did love him. A cracking little player. His pace is decent with 84 sprint speed. So not too bad at all. But his dribbling, it's not that good. It isn't amazing. You still can cope with him if you take it nice and slow. Don't rush too much. As long as you use that skill dribble, you still can get through. But he could do with a bit more in the dribbling department. Does have a three star skills, which is average, which is okay. You've always got the roulette to throw in. And a great part about Al Salawi's game is his positioning. He does have 84 attack positioning. And when you combine it with his high low work rates, it means he will be making a hell of a lot of searching runs, which is great in this game. Did end up leaving him with a hell of a lot of chances on goal, which he certainly can tuck away. He does have 88 finishing and was pretty damn prolific inside that box. Did get a couple of lucky bounces here and there, yeah, but on the whole, it was great at tucking the ball past the keeper. Really, really solid in front of goal, and he can get up to win those headers as well with that 95 jumping, so can be a threat in the air as well. So let's have a look at Inform Al Salawi's performance stats for you. So in seven games, he did manage to bag an impressive 12 goals, did get one assist as well. All the stat information is on the left, goal information top right. That position map bottom right does show you where all his goals were scored and that assist was created as well. So overall, we're giving Inform Al Salawi a cracking 9 out of 10. Did all the cracking scoring record with 12 in 7. And even with his limited dribbling ability, still managed to pick apart the defences. Did really enjoy using him. And he's a total, total bargain. Is that discard price? So amazing value for money. You've got to pick him up, uh, even if it is just a hold and resell. Do try him out though. Really do try him out in an ALJ Saudi League team. It is really surprisingly good. There are a lot of quality players. You've got two cracking centre-backs in there as well. So finally, we're just going to leave you with Inform Al Salawi's positive and negative to look at. Now, mainly all positives with Al Salawi. I couldn't really find that much wrong at all with him. Just his long range shooting wasn't really on point and his passing could be a little better. Couple stray passes, but as you know, passing can be a bit frustrating with the mad interceptions and pressure. Other than that, really is a cracking little striker up top, especially for the price. You really have got to pick him up if you're considering building a Saudi league team or a Saudi Arabian side brilliant brilliant discard inform player so please smash a like if you did enjoy the review it does help out a lot please subscribe if you're new to the channel as well loads more in-depth reviews and squad builders to come so stay tuned for them thanks a lot for watching lads I really do appreciate it cheers lads see you later